Now there are cases where we are supposed to prove a, a law that you already know maybe. Okay, so 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 let's say someone asks you to, to prove that. Prove that. We know this law very well in exponents, right from class 7 or 8. A B to the power n is A to the power n into B to the power n. Okay, is it true? We know it to be true by the very fundamental of the exponents, but let us try to understand. So, so is it true for n equal to 1? So, I will have to first of all set what my Pn is. Pn is both. It includes the LHS of this and the RHS of this. And the solution is, so, 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 so this, is, this is where the solution starts. I'm, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Solution is okay. So so P n is this, and, and we are checking it for P one. So P one is what a b to the power one is equal to a to the power one into b to the power one. So a b is equal to a b, which is true. Which is true. So I know P one is true. Therefore. P1 is true. So my trigger is set. Okay? It's there. Now now we, we, we come next. See. Let us assume. Let us assume. PK is true. PK is true. So 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 we say that PK a into b to the power k is equal to a to the power k into b to the power k and we have to prove that we have to prove that prove that 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 p k plus 1 is true okay so so p k plus 1 this is p p k plus 1 is, is a b to the power k plus 1 is equal to a to the power k plus 1 into b to the power k plus 1, right? Correct? So, so what happens next? What happens next? Now, I have to come from here to here, right? What do I do? What do I do? We have, we have from 1, right? 1. We have from 1 and let this be 2. I'm writing, I'm, I'm saying 1 and writing 2. Okay. We have from 1 a into b to the power k is equal to a to the power k into b to the power k. We have assumed it to be true. Okay, so that acts as a foothold for us. And, and to come here, what do I do? I multiply both the sides, okay, by a b. So, so a b to the power k into a b, okay, is equal to a to the power k into b to the power k into a b, okay. So, so this becomes a b to the power power k plus one. And this, since they are, they are products, multiplications, and they are commutative, they are associative. So, so I take this together, right? I take this together, then I, I commutate it, so A comes here and B goes there. I can do that. So, A, this is equal to A to the power A, A into B to the power K, and I can take any two, right? That is, that is the property of associativity. So, associativity and commutativity together applied give me this and this is equal to a to the power k into a into b to the power k into b which is equal to a to the power k plus 1 into b to the power k plus 1 okay so 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 i have proved that a into b to the power k plus 1 is equal to that which is which implies pk plus 1 is true. pk plus 1 is true. Okay? This is, is true. So, therefore, by 
PMI the statement PM is true for all natural numbers. Correct? You get that. Okay, so even the established truths, okay, the, the, the fundamental truths, they can be reestablished or checked using the PMI. So that 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 uh, I'll consider that is the fourth kind of uh, kind of proof that you are supposed to do in PMI. 